you know, George W. Bush, George H. W. Bush, Daddy Bush, is is in a sense the guy who sold out his principles exactly in public for the first time. Yep. You know, he was the guy who called Reaganomics for what it was. It yeah, was voodoo, voodoo economics. economics. Yep, that was his and word. And he was right. To win an election, he sold out his principles. Mm-hmm. And George H.W. Bush is the guy, as I understand, who hired a joke writer. Yeah. To give him fresh material to talk to Reagan about every day because he needed to suck up to this, you know, dim-witted, warmongering actor who was taking the country over the cliff. Mm-hmm. And he, because he wanted to be president and he knew that the only way for him to be president was to get the Reagan people to like him. Yes. And it was like, so, George H.W. Bush was the great capitulator. If Reagan was the great communicator, George H.W. Bush was the one who sold his principles out in public, showed his ass in public in exchange for power. And once that happened, the right, the core of the right, the racist, Falwell, bigot, Breitbart, Limbaugh core of the right realized what they could make those people do. They could make them fucking dance. Mm-hmm. And they've been doing it ever since. And, they, and then, then they'd finally just given up playing with them at all and driven them out of the party. Yep. They they brought it on themselves, Blue Gal. They brought it on themselves. 